Ooh, what's going on guys? This is Jake of Upfast Games, and this is The Wolf Among Us Part 3, I think. Uh, so let's go inside. Where are you going? Are we done? Yeah, I think so. I've seen enough. But... Okay. We should... move her before anyone shows up. We'll find out more at the business office. She'll be in the books. I'm sure of it. Big P, do you have any idea what's going on? How did this happen? Why her? Sorry, Snow. Just not ready to say yet. Fine. Let's just get upstairs. What the fu- I don't know what happened! I'm an asshole for not knowing? I'm gonna have to tell Crane about this. As long as King Cole is gone, he's acting mayor. He needs to know. And he's going to find out anyway, so we may as well get out in front of it. It'll just be worse if he finds out we held it from him. I know you don't like him, but he's our boss. This is part of the job. I guess it's useless to drag it out. That's how I feel too. I'm sure he won't be happy, but it's just part of the process. Hopefully he can be rational about it. I wouldn't hold my breath. I'm not. I just don't want him interfering. Crane's not what's important right now. We need to figure out who this girl was so we can find whoever did this. Take this back to Dr. Swinehart. He can take a look at it. I'll meet you at the business office. This will probably be the last part for a little bit. Uh, it's taken up a good portion of my hard drive, so yeah. What, are you blind? What, you don't see there's a line? I've been standing here a half hour already. Not really. Are we getting in a just fight? just walk in? Must be nice being the sheriff. Do whatever the fuck you like. I work here. And what great work you do, sheriff. Hmm. That didn't feel very genuine. Fucker. Because you are the one bringing this to me, Miss Snow. The one who so simply stumbled upon this catastrophe on our very doorstep. The last thing I need with Mayor Cole away is a hysteria. Do you understand me? Yes, of course I Don't do. Don't interrupt me, Miss Snow. You asked me a question. Don't change the subject. You are to blame for this unpleasantness, Miss Snow. I brought you this news as soon as I could. You are trusted to keep things running smoothly around here. This is a disaster. Who else is to blame if not you? Back off, Ichabod. It's not her fault. I don't need your help, Bigby. Instead of trying to assign blame, maybe we should figure out how to catch the fucker who did this. Oh, says the man who is most to blame for this catastrophe. How convenient. Sheriff, you are the one charged with protecting the citizens of Fabletown. Your failure to do so cost someone their life and the safety of the entire community. Tell me you've been doing something. Are there any leads? Suspects? Anything. Anything at all. Any shred of evidence you two know what the hell you're doing. Because right now, I have half a mind to fire the both of you. The woodsman is a person of interest. From what we've been able to gather, he was last seen with the victim. The woodsman? That drunk wretch was the cause of this? It's a lead. Nothing's certain yet. I'll find him. Get him in here if that's all you have to go on. You two need to get a handle on this situation quickly and quietly. The last thing we need is all of Fabletown knowing there's a killer amongst us. Snow. Yes? Sir? Call Vivian right this minute and let her know I'm coming in early for my massage. I will. Where is the bottle of wine you were to purchase? Don't bother. Forget it. Can't do anything right. Do your job, Sheriff. Or we'll find someone who can. You know what? Stop. We'll get on it right away, sir. You would have just pissed him off more. All right. Well, that could have gone better. Well, maybe we should have dragged it out. 
For what it's worth, I still think it was better to tell him. Yeah, maybe. Oh, Crane doesn't like people smoking and... Ah, oh, fuck Crane. Never mind. Smoke away. Who gets a massage this early? Crane. It doesn't really matter the time of day. A mere scent of stress and he's out the door. Is... is he gone? Yes, thankfully. Is the Wizard of Oz? Fuck is this shit? Buffkin! Hello, Miss Snow. Drinking? This early? Where did you get that? It was by Mr. Rickabod's desk. Then don't you think it probably belongs to him? Maybe. How are you today, Mr. Bigby? <laughs> yeah. Fine, Buffkin. Thanks for asking. Buffkin, get the books. Which books? Fuck off, Buffkin. The ones with all the fables in it. <laughs> Not sure that was any more specific. Bring the first three. Be back in a few minutes. He knows the ones I'm talking about. There's bound to be information on her here. Somewhere. We'll at least be able to get her real name from the books whenever Buff can find them. In the meantime, poke around. Maybe the mirror can help. I really have to get this appointment squared away, but let me know if you need anything. Hello, Vivian? Mm, Hi, this what's Snow this? White, Mr. Can I get a genie? Magic lamps are pretty much just lamps. After the genie's been freed. All right, thank you. Yes, that's worth a try. Yes, I mean. I wish for three more wishes. That's what any smart person would do. I and if they said no, that. if the genie told me that wasn't an option, I'd punch him in his fucking face. Well, that's not... Tarot cards. Jack brought them back from Appalachia. Who knows where they were before then. Or what he did to get them. I'll be sure to let him know. Strength. I guess it comes in all forms. Bestiality being one of them. Insurance fraud. Damn. Just what the fuck is this supposed to mean? My back hurts a lot. I always go with the simple. Just the simple answer every single time. Uh I guess the uh, the mirror? I I don't know. Fucking what? Oh, there we go. Hey, Magic Mirror. I got a question. You know the rule. I don't have time for this shit. Your impatience is callow. You're needlessly cruel. But have some respect for our history and rules. <sighs> mirror, mirror. If you're able, tell me all about this fable. <laughs> See? Was that so hard? Yeah, I'm about two seconds away from kicking a hole in you. There's no need for that. Fine. Of which fable do you wish to know? Show me the woodsman. Where is he? What you see is complete. The woodsman stumbles down a street. No shit. Which street? I'm sorry, Bigby. I can only show you what can be seen. Show me Buffkin. Hey! Put down the bottle and get to work! <laughs> Still looking! I don't know her name. Not yet, anyway. Well... 
Until you do, I can't help you. AIDS. Show me Snow White. Not much of a request. She's in this very room. Nobody right now. Very well. Please return should you wish to ask about someone else. Or someone new. Well, I'm sure we'll get it all cleared up. Okay. Thank you. This means tarot is a backwards art. I wouldn't put too much stock in its wisdom, Bigby. Not when you've been so helpful. Previsions muddy. I'm as clear as a window. Yeah, are ya? Oh wait, can I use this? No. Okay. Fuck it. Try anything else? Alright, done the lamp. Already did the tarot cards. Oh, what's this? We'll start with these. Any information on fables in our community will be somewhere in these books. Beast. Thanks for the input. Beauty and the Beast. Hmm. I think her name was Red. She didn't make it out. Red Riding Hood's knight in shabby armor. The woodsman? Yep. And his axe. And there's me. Not a good day. I'm pretty sure that's supposed to be me. Dirty whore. Yeah, dwarves. The less said about that, the better. One guy is enough for you? <laughs> Colin and his brothers. Alright, what else? I've seen this before. This symbol on the man's clothes, it's the same as the rings. Could be her father, or husband. This has most of the emblems of the old days, and usually what family they come from. If it's in here, we'll have her name. Is there any, uh, I want to make sure that there's any other that I missed. Yeah, see, there's a few more. I haven't seen Badger around for a while. He likes his privacy, I think. I wish Toad would like his a bit more. Nice hat. Ichabod Crane. Scared shitless. What's that? Your boss. His finest moment. Hard to understand how he ended up running this place. Well, maybe it's time that changed. Let's take a look. Alright, what's this? What? I can't read any of this shit. I can help. Yeah, can ya? You yeah. Fucking thanks. weird monkey. We look out for each other. Don't overdo it. Buffkin, translate. Hmm, an exquisite design from the good china of Toad Hall. Mr. Toad? He probably wrote this in himself. Okay. This looks familiar. Yes, from the Acts of the Woodsman, a druid blessing, actually. Someone blessed that thing. I only translate. What's that? It reads, Mark of the House of the Frog Prince. Not quite who I'm looking for. Ah, I missed something. 
What's it say about that? It says Bricklebit in an older elvish hand. What's Bricklebit? My magic word. What's it do? Makes animal shit gold. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Ah, this is the one. Where is this symbol from? Which family or story? That's an odd one. Family name? Alairao. I'll go look it up. Alairao. That means every kind of fur in German. Donkey skin. Yes. What does it say? Donkey skin girl, also known as donkey skin, also known as <laughs> ass skin, <laughs> uh, prefers to go by the name Faith. Poetic? Buffkin, we don't need the commentary. Yes, you do. The story of donkey skin. There was once a great king with a beautiful queen. The queen grew ill and had her husband promise to only marry the most beautiful girl in the kingdom. After a long search, it became clear that the only woman in the land that could match her beauty was... Oh. His daughter, Faith. She had a magic cloak made from the skin of her father's prized donkey that would hide her beauty so she could escape his kingdom. Eventually, she married a prince who could see past the magic cloak and knew her true beauty. And they lived happily ever after. Should I mark it, Miss Snow? Yes. Please. Jesus. And what's her husband's name? Lawrence. Prince Lawrence. We got what we came for. Yeah. Her name's Faith. She was married to Prince Lawrence. I mean, that's more than her we... name was Faith. Yeah. You should talk to the husband. You think he did it? Nothing would surprise me at this point. We can't rule him out. Alright, I'm gonna close out here. If you guys enjoyed the video, feel free to like and subscribe and all that shit, and I will see you guys next time.